Next, I'd like to wear, welcome Carol Rutten to present our Up and Comer Award. Now, this honor goes to lawmakers in the first two terms in office who demonstrate promise as bipartisan leaders. Carol represents Los Alamos National Laboratory. Carol? Thank you, Sam. Well, we are honoring New Mexico State Representative Sharon Klosh Chichilich as an up-and-comer in the New Mexico State Legislature. She is no, new, no newcomer to bipartisan public policy. In her nearly 35 years with Navajo Nation leadership, she fostered collaboration with both parties as well as among the many tribes and pueblos within New Mexico's borders. In her short term in office, she has already proven to be an effective advocate for child safety as well as rural tribal infrastructure. But the activity that resulted in her nomination for tonight's award was the New Mexico Gaming Compact. This bill, which had been introduced in prior sessions, finally passed this year. The passage was due in part to the representatives being able to bring together Democrats and Republicans, as well as a vast majority of, Nat of New Mexico's 23 Native American tribes, nations, and pueblos. In particular, in particular Representative Klaus Chichilich worked closely with the Navajo Nation, the Hickory Apache Nation, the Mescalero Apache Nation, the Pueblo of Acoma, and the Pueblo of Jemez to accomplish a beneficial compact for all parties. Please join me in congratulating Representative Klaus Chichilich. Good evening, and thank you for that beautiful introduction. I like that person. <laughs> I want to thank, I want to be, I, I want to thank all of you for being here. I feel like you're all supporting me. And I want to thank New Mexico first. This is indeed a recognition that I will honor because I am a freshman. Oh, no, I've graduated. I am a sophomore and I am on my way up to working my way through. Um, I, want, I want to share with you that my success is based on one very um, strong factor of my life, and that is that I am a former special education teacher of behavior disordered category. <laughs> Take that whatever way you want, but. <laughs> There are times when I feel like I'm still in the classroom and my job. <laughs> so I feel like a lot of my basis came from this. Um, I come from a very political family. From as far back as I can remember, I've listened to the stories of how to in politics. And so now that I'm there, I think one of the successes is recognizing who I am accepting that I am a politician, not a crook, and I love politics. And you have to in order to be effective. Looking at legislation, and we're talking about the gaming legislation, the success in pulling that through was looking at whether or not the mechanism was in place to get this piece of legislation through. And if it, and the pieces that were necessary is what we had to work on. And it entailed coordinating, working with everyone's agenda. And having to swallow periodically my own agenda, my beliefs, and having to retailor it according to what would fit for the best of everybody. So I, I just want to thank you all and thank you for recognizing the effort. I think you made a good choice. <laughs> and I will remember this. I mean, this is something I will not take carelessly, handle carelessly. Also, 
I think a lot of my success also goes back to the kind of people I associate with. I, I'm in good company being on the stage, and I'm so happy to be on the same stage of Clara Abdaka. She is an example of bipartisanship. I watched her with my family, with my uncle, my aunt, when my uncle was, in, was the Navajo Nation chairman. And I watched Clara and I watched Jerry Alpadaka as they worked through a lot of the issues with Navajo. I look at my dear friend, Mary Helen Garcia, another role model for me. I look at how she so gracefully and so beautifully modeled bipartisanship. I, I look at Larry Ladniaga, same thing. Plus, he comes from a beautiful family of men. I just want you all to know that. <laughs> and he's one of them. He's one of them. So, so there are many. I look at John Arthur Smith, another example of a man who models bipartisanship. So I'm in good company. So I'm still learning, and I have many beautiful people to learn further from. And again, thank you so much. And you have a nice evening. My husband is here, and I want to thank him, too, for supporting me through thick and thin. Thank you.